Intelligent Systems continues to prefer its long-shot picks, at least in terms of game selection anyway. Harden and Nina have long been overdue for appearances in Heroes, and while I'm puzzling a bit over another Tiki alt only a few months after her Brave version, and puzzling a lot over Mathis as the Grand Hero Battle Unit, this banner is about as close to my predictions as any of those in the last few months have gotten. Book 6 has just been one oddity after another though, with two Awakening banners and an Echoes banner when both games are running on empty in terms of marketable new heroes, as well as only a single Three Hopes banner for Fodlin, which marks a first since Three Houses came out during Book 3. We're due for a big shakeup with Engage set to become the hot new title in January, and I'm sure I'm not the only one wondering if Book 7 is going to be dominated by characters from that game in the same way that Three Houses has been such a favorite for the last three years. I don't think I'll be doing regular prediction videos for those banners, because there's just so much up in the air with a new release, but I'll definitely keep paying attention, and keeping track of just who's left to be added to Heroes for the sake of some of my own long-neglected favorites. What do you guys think of this banner closing out Book 6? Today's been a big day for Fire Emblem news overall, and I'd love to hear your thoughts down below. As always, of course, be sure to like the video and subscribe for more Fire Emblem content in the future. I've got a rather interesting project in the works for December that I hope you guys will enjoy, as we move on to a new book of heroes and prepare for a new mainline title. Au revoir!